Hello and welcome back to Abduction. Let's start by reading. The rate of dissipation is sensed and regulated automatically. The power is collected through the villain engineered extruded cables that attach directly to the dome membrane. When the maximum power level is exceeded, the dissipation phase is triggered, creating an electrical charge followed by a discharge into the water. Through electrolysis, an amount of hydrogen and oxygen is generated. We capture some of these elements for our own use, but the great majority is released into our atmosphere. This gassing might be a cause for concern, were it not for the ecosystem's ability to filter and maintain our atmosphere at near ideal levels. Excess R and O, H and O content and pressure generated by the process is rebalanced quickly by the membrane. And as you know, we discourage swimming when the bleeder is operational. Mr. Mayor, at your behest, here is the information pertaining to the bleeder, its history and some of the engineering behind it. The bleeder project was designed and built at the request of Mayor Sims to collect and dissipate the ever-increasing power in the entire ecosystem. Mayor Sims was reluctant to allow the system to come to fruition as he and others had become suspicious of Mayor Farley's death. He believed that without knowing more precisely what would happen to the cell wall at fruition, it was ill-advised to allow it to possibly open, thus allowing what might be outside in, and what might be inside out. The system has the capacity to throttle all your concern connected worlds. The idea, as you are well aware, is to suppress the ecosystem power and thus inhibit full maturity of the trees. It was postulated and since became apparent that this suppression will keep whatever unknown maturity process from happening and grant us direct control over tree fruition. Okay. Hmm? Oh. Okay. I think I did something. Don't really show what. Ooh. Okay, it made some sounds. Oh. Special Council Session 2 discussed final approval of Farley's plan with regard to the imminent attack. The full council vote was anonymous, and I gave my final approval. Preparation update. Farley says that tunneling is almost complete. Fame informs us that the villain just completed their construction and have started testing. Special council session 12, it was 11, not 2. Uh, no one attended. I will inquire as to reason for their absence. It appears that the council members feel like we're having too many meetings since the plan has been approved perhaps we can reduce our meetings to every two days for now while i was asking cecil about his abs absence i also inquired about securing the tower area a special council session 13 cecil will provide a new key code for the lower lock in the next few days cecil was concerned about any survivors not having access so it was decided that we would conceal the code in Fali's house and give the residents the location as they were being uh, chambered. I also had him change the upper tower access code. A clue to that code has been placed under the direction of our first mayor. I have decided to bring some of the more important mayor's logs with me for chambering, especially the initial Harnath log and then the logs that document the history of our conflict with the Mofang. I would think we would have an extra chamber available for oh, uh, for historic documents. Special Consultation 14. Only Fam attended. He informed me that, because of the dire circumstances, the others were either extremely busy or not inclined to have long discussion about the situation. I told him I would suspect suspend the regular special council sessions and we would simply meet at the need arose. I paid a, paid a visit to Farley today. I asked her to check on the availability of the chamber for the documents. 
I've spent the last few days collecting documents. I divided them into two categories, chambered and vaulted. The vaulted are less important, but obviously worth making an effort to save. They can be moved into Fale's vault area. The vaulted category will also include any books that we are managed to collect through the years. With less than a week remaining before chambering begins, the population is tense. We've had several town hall meetings to try to answer any questions, but the realities of the current situation makes make it difficult to assure, assure fears. Fali has informed me that there is one fine confirmation, final confirmation from Chavar. If Fali doesn't hear from her by the end of 174AH, uh, then there is no turning back. There is an odd justice to Fali's plan in that whatever the Mofang bastards sent to kill us will be returned back to them. Special Council Session 15. A special meeting was called to go over the plans for the final time. Fali had several instruction sheets to distribute. The Mofang weapon illustration, a list of all souls that will be used as a basis for the chambering manifest, and a thorough summary of the battle plans. This will be distributed as necessary. No word from Chavar. Fali tells me that there will be at least one chamber available for historic doc documents. Any other extra chambers will be loaded with emergency provisions and medications in case either Hundrath or Marai are completely destroyed. No word from Chavar. No word from Chavar. Death is on our doorstep. Curse the Mofang devils to hell. I am leaving to be chambered. This journal will remain here to inform any future souls of what our last days were like. Can I take it? Colorado. That's six, four, eight, four, eight, D, D, C. T D. This again, warning. Is this one of the Mofang things? Oh, and we are here. I swear the geometry of this place is a little bit weird. Why? Just a thought. Mayors, do the Roscoe? Uh, before Hunraf, so Luther was okay, okay, okay. Um, Luther Rosco, uh, 500 before Hunraf, two, three before Hunraf, and 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 mm, what was that about? The uh. Um, a clue to the code has been placed under the direction of our first mayor. Under the direction of our first mayor. Huh. You mean in his grave, perhaps? Is it not working? I need it to work. Okay, maybe this is the moment where I need to disable the garage. Wait, oh no. Let's check how the energy is distributed right now. Oh, everything is powered. So what is that for? Let's check the phone book first. Just to make sure I... Oh. Ah, so I was re reading that wrong. Operator. So it's like one empty. Two is A, B, C, three. D, E, F, G, 
GHI5. So it was moved to the left. See, it's that simple. And it's not... Okay, and... I think I was uh, remembering French alphabet, not the one that was necessary, because I remember Q before R. And zero is operator. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um. Just want to check her. If it. Uh, by any chance, because downtown will it change anything? If it does, then I don't know. <laughs> It's still out of power. Okay, so it doesn't matter if the garage is powered or not. So let's power it back on, maybe? Um, mm, yes. <laughs> I know I'm running back and forth almost made mindlessly, but I don't have any other idea what can be done. I mean, I have an idea what we can do, but I want to check this one first. For the downtown, maybe means that, you know, downtown, the place below, something like this. Um, yeah. So, we need to go back to that six digit code check it away once again mm. now it will be quicker because I just see have it in front of my face and won't have to think which number corresponds to which letter it will be quicker And we haven't seen any more fun yet. Not that way. I was wondering, hmm, can we go f to the left? Have I been to the left? Yes, we've been. There's nothing important right now. And we still need to visit that grave. Oh my goodness. Okay. So. I'll put this card away. Um, six. A. Nine. Four. One. Five. No. Okay, maybe let's start with the one that I found lately. 4, 8, D, C, T, D. Got them. W one six seven okay one 
Can I input help me? Uh, B. A. D. X. It's fine. Six. One. No. One. Seven. Two. Nine. One six three one zero seven okay two four four one five Hello? Um. Okay, which one was that? Eight, four, one, five, three. This one works. Um, let's go up first. Ah, it worked! Yet, as I understand, okay, I think this is a detonator. Okay, so not yet. This is the control panel that the villains have supplied to our use, although they are able to control their system via... Oh! Hmm. I did that. I solved it. Yes, and apparently my um, worksheet uh, looks similar, but like full. Yes, I managed to solve it. Oops. Mm -hmm. Oh! And that should open the gate. Yes, we can get to the tree. No, here. Expected?
For some reason, I didn't think it would go so deep underground. Definitely wasn't expecting something like this. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Voltage? Oh. to go through or oh, are you not ready? Okay, so solid color means that I cannot go through. It was worth trying. But uh, as I understand now, we need to report back to Cecil. Of course, take your time. Oh. Changes. Okay. Cecil, those weren't here before. Cecil, the tree, it's alive. Cecil! And we need to check the... Did it? We can check it if I didn't disconnect it by accident. This way. Uh, we still need to check this uh, L L Luther Roscoe's grave. No, it looks so connected, alright. So maybe let's do that first. But that I'll leave that for tomorrow. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!